Hello, this is Dango1867. Hope you're all feeling alright today because I am Tickety Boo. We have got the Stuani second in form player review, the Uruguayan international currently plying his trade in the Spanish top flight for Girona FC. Stats on the screen right now, he's got a nice 71 pace, a big 85 shooting and 76 passing, 83 for his dribbling, 52 defending and a very good 83 in regards of the physical as well. He has three star weak foot but a nice four star skill, six foot one, can play striker all right midfield and has medium and low work rates. The specialties and traits for this Uruguayan striker are poacher, aerial threat, clinical finisher and complete forward for the specialties with power header and technical dribbler in regards of traits. Pros and cons for this very, very impressive striker are his skill moves with the four star. If you are a skiller, he's definitely one of the players you want to look at in Spain. He is absolutely beastly in the air. One of the best target men I've used and I do like target men as you may have realised from watching my reviews. So a skiller who is good in the air and is shooting 85 rated, a big, big 85 shooting makes him very, very formidable. He isn't very quick in regards of his cons, only 71 pace and it feels a little bit slower in game. And his work rate does mean that a lot of the time he does drop further back and sadly that weak foot lets him down. He's shooting if it's in the air or on his good foot, you're definitely gonna be having plenty of goals. If not, you might struggle. Uh, let's get on to the highlights for this legendary Uruguayan. So straight away, his strengths are that heading. He's one of the best headers of the ball in the entire division. So if you are using a Spanish side and like a target man, you should look no further at this beautiful second in form. He is very, very physically strong. He has skill moves as well. So if you are a skiller and you like a solid strong forward to use him, this guy will get you past defenders and obviously with that strength he will hold them off as well. He plays in Spain which means you've got to say lots of really quick players to play around him, giving him that service, getting the balls into the box just like this and I've got to say finishing wise one of the best finishers in the air or in that case the chest I have used on the game and giving him a very very impressive 8.5 out of 10. He's not very cheap either. Only downside is pretty much his pace. If you are looking for sweat, obviously this is not the forward to use. But if you like slow build up, if you like a bit of skill, and you like putting balls into the box, this guy will get you goals for days. And if this guy gets a third in form, which is very, very likely he's having a cracking season this year, then you can have one of the best strikers on the game. I kid you not. At the start of the season, I doubt anyone would have seen this card coming, but it's very, very impressive. So if you're using a Spanish side, get him in there, try him out. I promise you will not obviously regret that decision. Hopefully you've enjoyed this review. If you have tried him out, let me know how he got on. Drop a like, comment and subscribe. I've been Dango. Catch you all later, guys.